Rolling. Hey everyone, it's Presley at games.com here, and today we have a guide in one of our National Geographic books, which is how to feng shui your room. So that's what we're doing today. Let's get started. Okay, so the number one thing, this is kind of in a list, is to hang a mobile. So we're going to use my dream catcher and we're going to hang it right up there where I had a big blue thing hanging down. Here's us taking that down. And here is us replacing it with the dream catcher. Oh, hi. So this is a bell. So number two was to hang this bell. So when people walk in, it rings and you can know when people walk in. Number three is to hang three pictures of your family and friends in a triangle. So here are some of my family and friends in a triangle. Number four is to draw a picture of what you want and put it under your mattress. Now I'm not going to do that on the vlog, but I am going to do that tonight. Number five is to move a desk or bookcase to the left side of my door. Well, our bookcase and desk will not fit here, so we decided just to put this little thing, but it works. So number six is to put a quartz on your, next to your bed to improve concentration, and boys are supposed to put it on the right, and girls are supposed to put it on the left, so mine is on the left. And here's the quartz which I got on vacation. It is so pretty. Number seven is to have a bulletin board of all your achievements, and some of my achievements are very large, so I'm just gonna hang them in the area of this bulletin board. But for now, we're gonna have the smaller ones. Here I have my horse badges from when I used to do horse camp. So I was best at keyhole and cone. So um, I think they're the kind of the same thing. You have to like drive your horse through an obstacle horse. And this is from my skydiving vlog. I'll put a link to that in the description. And here, is from Starfest. I'll also put a link to my vlog from that in the description. So this is my costume contest thing. And yeah, those are my accomplishments that are going to be on my board. Number eight is to put a stuffed animal version of your Chinese birthier animal on your bed. And luckily, I have a stuffed chicken for no reason. So I have a pet stuffed chicken. That will now be my bed chicken. The next one, which is number nine, is to have three pillows on your bed to have fun with your friends and make new ones. So luckily, I have this giant pillow lying around, which could be perfect. Just put my pillows on and be like, uh. <laughs> Number 10 is to place a plant somewhere in your room if you want to spend more time with friends and family which I do because I like to spend time with my friends. So I'm gonna keep him plant right here. And then number 11 is to place a light green bowl or purple bowl on anywhere in your room. So when entering or leaving the room, you can put some change in it. So I actually think you put it over here. So when entering or leaving the room, you put change in it just in case you have some extra change in your pocket to save money. And finally, number 12, is keep your bed on the side of your room so you can see your door at all times, which I have already done because my bed is on the side of my room. So according to this guide, my room is now feng shui. See you tomorrow, bye.